Hello and welcome to a concept that I call the Sun Seasons. Now I created this little visual here to help me explain how I look at the seasons and it's not necessarily a calendar se season, it's more of a sun intensity season. So when we look at the most intense rays of the sun we get each year, it's at the summer solstice which is around June 21st and the least intense we get is around December 21st. So with those two anchoring points, one is a peak and one is a valley, I can set up my seasons on three month little intervals, just like the normal seasons. They're just askew a little bit. So I take summer not starting in June, I take summer starting in May, which is the month and a half before June 21st, and it goes till August 6th, which is the month and a half after. That means my summer three month block is from May 6th to August 6th, where the sun is the most intense. So that's what I'm preparing my skin for. And by doing that, I start back here in March or maybe even in February by exposing my skin slowly and gradually as the sun gets more and more intense coming out of winter so that by May, when I get into the summer season, i am already developed a little bit of resilience and strengthen my skin to be able to handle these peaks. I don't start tanning, I don't start getting out in the sun here in the end of May, end of June, because I'm already at the peak. That's like jumping in the deep end. I like to wade in, adjust, acclimate, and be able to handle all this so that when I get to August, I'm already on the downslide. I've already developed a good base, and all I'm doing is getting less and less intense till I get to this valley, which then I give myself a break during the winter because that's when I want to let the skin rest. You don't want to be tanning all year. This is the natural rhythm of the sun. You let your body expose itself, and it will go right along with you. If you jump in here, you're going to get burned, literally. So hopefully this gives you a little bit of a visual as to how to approach the sun and your sun management and developing some tolerance and acclimation with your skin. All right, good luck this summer.